Hello everyone, uh, I've got a new 3D printer development to share with you this time. It's a colour blending extruder. Um, it's a three-way um, extruder and mixer. Um, so what we've got here, we've got three separate uh, NEMA 14 uh, motor extruders with uh, herringbone gears um, and they're all connected individually so they can be each individually controlled and they're all forcing um, the uh, filament into a single hot end so that's doing the blending uh, and pushing out uh, a final um, filament. Uh, we've got uh, in this particular one I've got it set up so we've got yellow, blue and red uh, 1.75 millimeter filaments from Faberdashery. Um, these tubes here are just to stop the filaments from um, from getting tangled up, they're not actually, it's not a bound setup, it's a direct setup. Okay, so at the moment it's printing a, a little stretchlet uh, bracelet. Uh, you could obviously use different materials as well. Um, I've got all three extruders enabled on this one to give a really nice uh, colour uh, effect, which I'll show you in a second uh, what you can get from that. Um, the uh, electronics are a modified are a ramps normal ramp setup, but a modified uh, bareboard Sanguina Lulu that's just got the um, three extra stepper drivers uh, fitted onto it. Uh, I explain how to do that on my blog, so do take a look. Um, let's have a look at some of the th cool things it can do then. First of all, I've got uh, this little one that I printed earlier. Um, this is. Uh, one of my universal paste extruders and it's actually uh, got uh, pearl uh, white, yellow and red fitted uh, and these are colour switched so they've been blended, two, two colours have been blended together uh, usually the pearl has been on um, most of the time and then switched between the yellow and red um, and because the way the blending uh, extruder end works it works a little bit like uh, multicolored toothpaste, so you end up with um, different effects uh, on the different edges or the different sides of your printed part, which is quite nice. Uh, actually, more nicer than that fully blending, uh, fully mixing the color into just a single color. Uh, so this one, you've got a little bit of a pearl tint. Uh, this end, not so much. You've just got the yellow and red on this side. Uh, I think that one is quite quite pearly and then that on the end is the most pearly one um, so it gives a really nice uh, little um, effect on there. I've got other things like Nautilus gears which is quite nice and they're different coloured. Another stretchlet bracelet this was a two colour one so this was dark blue light blue as you turn it around you can see and it's the same on the inside as well. Just put dark blue and light blue. Quite nice. Got a little uh, cyan, magenta, and yellow frog. I do like printing frogs. So we've got the different colours as you turn them around. The same little pop, cyan, magenta, and yellow. And this one's pretty cool. This is a uh, herringbone gear for an extruder and as you turn it you'll see hopefully it goes from silver to orange and back again. We've got a dual colour Rostock part it's for a Rostock printer so we've got yellow on one side and red on the other. And another little stretch like this was um, I think this was, yeah, this was purple, blue, and green. So you've got, uh, as you turn it around, it changes from green, blue, and then purple. Oh, and of course, an uh, iPhone case. Okay, well, I do hope uh, you like the, uh, the video and also the blog. Uh, if you want to uh, contact me, uh, obviously the blog uh, address is richrap.blogspot.com um, I've got a web uh, site now so that's richrap.com and if you want to email me 
uh, that's richard.richrat at gmail.com. Um, look forward to hearing from you. I hope um, someone decides to build one of these. They're really good fun. Um, I'll see you later. Thanks for looking. Okay, so the, uh, the stretch look brace looks just finished printing. Uh, I just wanted to show you it because it looked rather cool. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so this one is uh, red, yellow, and blue. So as we turn it around, we get the blue, and then we get the red, and then we get back to the yellow. And it's also the same on the inside as well.